Welcome to my custom interloper run. I'm Nifo29, and here's what's in our backpack. We're a little underweight. We got some wood. We got some coal. Clothing is all good. We have a lot of cattails. We got some wa uh, water on the stove. This gun's at 77. And that's what we got there. And we got those saplings. We are day 252, and there it is. Ice fishing's the only thing that's not at 5. And we are early morning. There we go. Hey, OG, welcome in. Oh, damn it. <laughs> I, I, I threw that on there. I forgot to put water in it. Idiot. <laughs> Idiot. Well, let's... That's only six minutes. Uh, five till melted. I need another stick. There we go. Uh, let's eat up. And let's drink up. And where is a good spot? I want to drop that meat that I have for scent. We don't need that. Uh, we don't need to be dragging these around. And uh, I'm going to keep that case. Just in case we do do some fit. Oh, look at this. Beautiful day. What's the time of day? Oh, yeah. Uh, let's go see if we can get some of that moose. It's nice and sunny, but it's three bars down when we're outdoors. Wind is minus 17. Hopefully we can get this done. I don't know. I mean, if I can't get a wind block off of this moose, it's going to be pretty tough. And I'm going to drop that there. And just crawl around this guy. Well, I'm going to put a fire here. And hope for the best. That's all I can do. No, the wind is blowing. It's That's how hard it's blowing, which is pretty hard. I get into you. I want the moose. I saw the moose, but that's wolf. There's moose. What am I stuck on? Like, can I not walk right in there? Wow. Okay. Well, give me the moose. Where is it? <laughs> oh, man. That was a little bit frustrating.
Alright, we got a little bit of meat that we can cook. <laughs> I would love to be on this side so I can just click on them and do it, but it ain't working. There you are. Uh, let's take five. Yeah, the fire is kind of in the moose. <laughs> you think he should thaw out a little bit quicker, eh? What do we got? 31 minutes on that? Uh, I didn't realize I have that chunk of meat. I'll go with that. Yeah, these hitboxes are wonky. Like, they've been... They've been kind of ridiculous for a while. even going to get this entire moose or are we going to run into you know what go six whoops to get an already cooked bonus <laughs> yeah I cut the meat off and he's like it's a moose roast Uh, how much? 25. Fire's still going good. That'll work. got two hours on there so I gotta be careful that I don't walk into the fire that way and right, 6.9 I'm gonna take the whole thing and we want to try and get the hide in the guts Uh, I'll drop two pieces. I'm gonna do that. Yeah. There you go. That way that small piece gets cooked. Okay, we got 20 minutes. This time of day, it's like midday. Take the hide. You must flip your knife like that when you're d doing this. Alright. There we go. Fire gets blown out. Um, I'm just wondering if maybe we won't worry about the guts. Because they take forever. Nah, it doesn't want me to be anywhere near it. Yeah. You know what? Let's just go. 
Make sure to collect the knuckle as well. <laughs> no. Now what's my plan here? Is it to bring this meat up to the to the cabin? And then do possibly do some fishing. I would love, 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 love to get some lantern fuel. Wonder how far I can go. Can't turn worth crap though. Can we move? We can barely walk with this much gear. We can barely walk. All right, we're at seventy-three. We'll drop that amount. And we'll get inside, we'll warm up a little bit, come back for the rest of that meat. Uh, this little area, I don't really know where a good fire spot is. Yeah, having food at multiple places is a good idea, Murd. It's just not really my thing though, right? I'd I mean, I guess on one hand, if I had food scattered all over the place, I wouldn't actually have to remember where it was. But I'd kind of have to keep track of where it was, in a sense, because if I eat it all in one location and go back one day and I'm thinking, hey, oh, I don't got to worry, I got food over there. Well, this way I know where all of my food is. It's not necessarily the most ideal way, but it helps my not forgetting. Cold. <laughs> I get to that spot, I know. I'm like, okay, there's that. That's how much. The weather in this place is just horrendous. Like, they don't even hang out and give you a fire barrel out here, do they? No. Hmm. Let's take this. Close the door. Alright, I don't want... Uh, you know what, let's throw the meat out here. Get back in here, warm up. Um, we're almost warm. Oh, look at you. I didn't even see you. Ah, our knife is at 70. I don't care. Hmm. Okay, well, let's eat up and drink and go get the rest of that meat. Oh, did you hear that? I heard them. Ah, you know what? We don't need Tarmigan. It's almost nighttime, too. Uh, aft 
after we deal with this moose, we gotta go find that other bear. That other bear should have been number 27, I guess. This pack is getting too heavy to carry. It was a sunny day, but it wasn't really a good day. But we got to find that bear because I don't want him to despawn. I don't know how long it takes for him to despawn, but... We gotta go have a look for them, but we also need to do a little bit of fishing so we can get some lantern fuel. up here yeah you heard those guys you know what I want the time again you know why we got time to kill is that them right there or are those rocks those look like rocks they sounded real close uh, you know what let's deal with this meat first we'll have some on the front porch and we'll also have some on the back porch how about that uh if we get ptarmigan then i can repair this it's only a 93 it's not a big deal but they sound right here those are rocks just on the other side but I won't feel so bad about repairing that if I have more. What is this? What are these? Really? Those rocks looked a little bit large. Oh wow, they are way farther than I thought some place to escape this cold uh, that guy was too close and you stop That's all right. Damn, I'm freezing. Hmm. Right when Will started talking, I thought I heard ptarmigans again. the other side of the cabin. Oh, okay. So that away? 
I just thought I heard some uh, again right there, but Will started talking and then I didn't hear them again. Uh. Feels like a lot of gear. You know what? Let's go inside. Oh. <laughs> I'm thinking I can just, you know, walk right through the door, right? And it'll open. Alright, I'm gonna drop this moose meat over here. now we can harvest some time again um you know what i'm not gonna do i'm not even gonna take the meat i don't need it oh here comes the storm uh let's take you And you. So in the morning, we'll, uh, depending on what the weather is like, uh, we'll go have a look. Either for the bear, or we'll go fishing. Oh, we have an Aurora. But no sounds. It's like a rad storm. Now let's do that and we'll do that. We got a whole bunch of cloth, we got a whole bunch of uh, down, and now our insulation is better. What's our... You're at 73. Why not? And... Eat up. Yeah. We got the chickens. Oh, man. We don't have any water. Oh, look at that. 29. We need water, but we can't do it here. We can't do like 0.5 at a time. I mean, it sucks having the cans, but um, at the very least, we're going to have to go to that cave and Maybe make a fire up there. I only have two cans. Yeah. I mean, I have this can over here, but... Now... I'm going to leave these saplings... We don't really need them. But I do want those. And we're out. Uh, well, let's make 0.5. Or maybe we'll make two, two rounds. And get ourselves a little bit closer to daylight. Uh, problem is I'm running out of sticks. I don't want to use these, but I guess we don't have a choice. I 
There we go. Let's go out this way. Ah! You know what? We have to go down the same way anyway. Foggy weather. I don't want fog. Maybe we'll find some sticks out here, though. Problem is, I want to kind of maintain my heading. Make sure. Oh, wow. We need bullets. <laughs> That's not the way we went down. I think we got to go this way a little bit more. I'm going to get myself lost in this fog. I am not too familiar with this area. Oh, we got one stick. to take a drink of my coffee. Alright, somewhere across the way we should encounter... You know what? Hmm. It's gonna suck, but you know what? We can go to, there it is. We can go to the fishing hut. We'll just throw some tip ups outside. Um, actually, can we do it on this one? Take you. Close enough. Uh, we want to use that. Oh wow, look at our temperature. Throw you in there. Let's get a fire going. My thinking is, you know what, we can probably just boil water while we got these tip ups. Uh, never felt so just cold a piece of coal. Two of those. Do that. And that. Drink that. And maybe. Six still melted. Thing is, I don't know how long it takes. Uh, let's use this. I don't know if that water is going to boil over. Oh, it didn't. So now we can just chill out here. I'm just kind of wondering, should I bother fishing regular? Now, the speeding time, does that help with the tip ups or no? That I don't know. I should check how long this fire is, two hours. Uh, 
I might have to drop some gear. Uh, I got one fish. I'll get us a little bit of oil. I'm not going to fish here. Uh, but I will look for some more cattails. Well, it doesn't seem to be any. What is it? Midday? 19? Uh, I'll throw you back on there. We got an itty bit of fuel. Not really enough to do anything. Um, well, those tip-ups are not as productive as I was hoping they would be. It's not really worthwhile to fish normally unless I plan on doing five hours in this mode. Does it matter, though? Or does it just feel like it matters? Like, if you do one hour and you don't catch anything, does it really matter? Like, those five hours actually do a better job of catching fish in that first hour? Um, let's throw water on you. Whoops, hey. What are you at? Nine till boiled. All right. We're only going to stay here, I think, until this, uh, until this fire goes out. I don't think we're going to go much longer than that. 25. Throw some of that there. Uh, well, I may as well throw one in here. Another well, it's point three, it's a little bit better. Point zero three, actually. What does that even look like? It looks like that. <laughs> well, I guess we technically got some lantern fuel, but this isn't gonna cut it. Uh, 21 minutes. What's our water at, at this point? 404. Okay, water is not a problem anymore. But you're 1, 126. Yeah, these are just tiny little fish. We'll do that. I'm going to save some room for a tea. Eight minutes. Oh no. Okay. Uh, we're gonna go this way. We're gonna go up to the cave. Well, is it a blizzard or is it not? 
Okay, well, it's not. Let's go back. I gotta heat up a drink. I forgot. <laughs> Is it just this spot? Like, if I go past... Oh, maybe not. Alright, what do we got? 11 minutes, just enough time. Uh... We can do that. Almost night time. Oh, I don't want to go back to this cabin, but you know what? We probably should. I think it's the smarter thing to go back to the cabin. I mean, I would like to go somewhere different, you know that? Like, I don't want to just hang out right here. But the sound of the weather, that was... What we were just hearing was blizzard sound, so we don't have a blizzard. But the sounds are still making me a little nervous about heading out anywhere. Because, to be honest, I would love to go that way. We have enough time. Let, you know what? I don't know what's going on with the sound. We're going to head out and look for that bear. Worst case scenario, we get lost in a blizzard and have to look for the hangar. Something that never happens to us, right? <laughs> So a normal stream for knife. Well, yeah, that's what I'm thinking. You know, doesn't hurt to take those. We got lots of scent. I don't think there are too many wolves in the area. Which is good. Lots of deer. Uh, is that cave just over here or is it over there? I think it's over here. And where... Is that the bear? Let's go have a look. Is that the bear or is that a rock? Because he, I, I don't remember at this point, which, uh, he ran behind a rock formation. And then we just kind of lost sight of him. Where were we? We were there, so I, that's probably the rock formation he ran behind. That might be the bear. That will be amazing luck if it's him. And he was that easy to find. I think it is him. That doesn't look like a rock.
I do believe that is him. Not too far from the bear's cave either. Does that mean the bear's cave is just over here? Oh, yes it is. That's good, we can go in there and warm up. Uh, where are, oh boy. We're not gonna deal with him today. We're definitely gonna get ourselves close enough to, to make a confirmation that that's actually him. But I think it's pretty obvious it is. We just want to prove it in court. Let's get in here and warm up. <clears throat> the thing is, I don't know what game day I shot him on. I think it was only one day. Uh, what can we do? Let's eat some fish. Oh no, my water. I got water that's not boiled. Alright, what does that look like? <laughs> it's still the same, obviously. Uh, I'm not repairing anything. How much cloth do we have? We have a lot of cloth. I can drop that. I <laughs> forgot I had that. Just been walking around with that. How much does that weigh anyways? Five kilograms. Uh... Let's just do this. Oh, listen to that. This pack is getting kind of heavy. I don't want to leave that behind because what if we harvest that guy and we don't have to come back this way? Oh my, look at it. It's beautiful. That's our bear. We don't even need even need to see him, we got the crows. Alright, now if only he will give us a wind block. Uh, I think we have 38. Well, if you have 38, you may as well have 40, right? I'm going to aim the travel out that way. And we're going to throw you in there. And we'll keep that. Oh, that dirty water. Oh, we got a wind block right there. Did I just use... What did I use for wood? <laughs> I think I used a torch. Uh, we want some coal. I'm gonna hold off on that. Uh, let's go. You know, 
wondering if I'd notice the moose eye. Oh, son of a... Here. You know what? Uh, let's put you in front. There we go. Now we can do that. Go seven. Sure. Oh, I don't like that wind. You know what? Take that. All right, what do we got? 21 minutes. Fire still okay. It's nice not harvesting meat from his foot. <laughs> right, let's do that. I think that's all of it. We just have the fish. I'm not worried. Oh boy. Well, it's only minus seven. That's not going to blow it. Just please don't pick up. Let's go five. The sun's setting. It's gonna get a lot colder soon. Yeah, I think uh, when night hits, we'll, well, when we're done this bear, provided the, the fire doesn't blow out. Uh, you know what? Let's do that. Um, I think we'll head back to the hangar. And then I think in the morning we can head over to zone of contamination because we got the both of the bears and we got the moose out here it's kind of what we came out here for Ten minutes. It's a little sketchy to do this. Fire's still good. What is the wind like? It's picking up. Uh, the guts will be questionable on this one. I want the hide, but I don't know that we're going to care about the guts.
Uh, 30 minutes. Should get the hide. Let's do that. And you're fifty five, and you can go in there. Kind of have a look for wolves. I think a lot of the wolves are dealt with already, but you never know. Uh, do that. We have 45. It's an outdoor fire, so it's a lot longer. Possibly double. Yeah, it's a pretty night. It's not terrible out, which is nice, really. Alright, that's all we're gonna do for that. Um, actually, I'm gonna throw these in here. I'm gonna take the last two guts. And then we'll cook up a tea and head out. Thing is, I would stay in that bear cave if I knew it was warm enough without a fire. You know, I just don't know that. Pull you out. Oh, let's put you back. And whoops, now we'll pull you out. Yeah, it's a nice clear day or night. It does not sound good. Wind is minus twenty six. <laughs> it would be cool if that was actual, you know, the actual stars in our sky. I need a stick. The one at the bottom. I don't know which one. I don't want to be scanning around. I want to make sure I'm still headed roughly in the right direction. I think right about there we should be good. Murd wants a stretch. That's an early one. You must have started your timer. <laughs> You must have started your timer when we uh, started the stream the first time. Before we had some technical difficulties. Alright, I can see the buildings. We're all good. 
just a matter of how much condition will we lose on the way. So dirty, Merg. I, you have to make me look, right? I saw the alert, but I, you know, I can't just ignore it. I was going to say something and now I forgot. Oh, well, we got two bears worth of, of meat. And we have a moose. We got a lot of meat out here. And funny enough, we're leaving. Probably. Not sure why I feel so tired. Might try a little bit more fishing. I do want lantern fuel. I don't want to be carrying torches, but I mean... Oh, you know how many fish a guy's got to catch? To get the lantern to have like even half fuel. My fingers feel numb. Oh, we haven't lost our uh, temperature yet we will shortly it just means we won't really lose too much condition we won't have to waste a birch bark or a uh, herbal while we sleep now for the broken runway I think we're good I'm just happy to not be back on the island. I don't know, it's... We were at the helicopter a whole lot longer than we were at the island. It just... I wasn't happy being at the island. I have bad memories of that place. Alright. We will put you... can't carry this any further oh we literally can't move all right uh, bear meat we'll keep all the cooked yeah you know what I want to look at these torches and see which are the better of them all uh, we'll do that just inside. Uh, I also want to check how many matches. Okay, we only have two. Uh, we have... You know, we have a fair amount. Are you, remember, I forgot. We found a bow. Yeah, we did. Carrying an extra bow now. Um... Uh, Actually, I'm going to hold off on the torch. Go grab some more matches. You know, I was content with carrying the fire strikers. Uh, 10 should be enough total, right? I was content with just using the fire strikers. But since I found that pack of matches, I'm like, hmm. Take one more. Hey, Roller, welcome in. Uh, give me a second here and I'll do the, the coffee. Let's 
place you right there and we got another one of you right there and do we have guts we have guts throw you down here oh damn it I threw the moose hide down here it's starting to weigh me down not very often I have a moose and a bear hide at the same time oh damn it did I just waste my match I don't care yeah I did I don't care. We got a whole bunch of matches in there. Not a big deal. I knew that 10% torch wasn't going to last very long and I still went and did that. You can go back up there so you're out of the way. And we'll do that. And time to eat. Get rid of the fish. And are all these one? You're not. Um, I don't want partials left on me. Okay, they're all one. I'll do this. And... Here we go. Thanks, Roller. 29 matches. Babbage needs one. <laughs> yeah, he's... I haven't seen his streams for, for a bit. <laughs> Is he still on the the same roll with it? Oh man. I hate this basement for this one reason is it's so dark. It's like the middle of the day and we can't see nothing. But I guess that's why it keeps the insomnia away, right? Um, I'm going to grab some more matches, to be honest, but I'm going to sort these torches. I don't want you, you or you. We got five that are above the 40s. Uh, let's just take five. It gives us 13 total. That's way more than we need. Oh, uh, did he did he end that run or did it end on him? He's a cave dweller now. Diet outer diet outer loper. What does what is diet outer loper? I get the outer loper part. What's the diet part? Ooh, thirteen. <laughs> yeah I specifically took 13 matches just to make you happy there Merd <laughs> but yeah like for the longest time I was content with just using the fire strikers but it, ever since I found that one pack of matches I'm like hey you know what why not right and now it's I'm struggling To let go of the matches. He won on day 303, you believe, on in Blackrock. Oh, nice. Nice. That's a tough challenge he was doing. Well... I don't know. I'm going to go on this side of the rock. I don't know if it matters. But we're going to the zone of contamination. Here's something I don't know. Does 
the coal in the mine respawn. Or are we stuck with our three pieces? Oh, dude. We got more than three pieces. This is just what we actually took while we went on our little journey. Oh, man. We can't leave all that coal here. We're not coming back. We might need it. You believe the coal in the mine does respawn. How much coffee? I have lots of coffee, right? Yeah, it's just not made. Uh, I should almost just turn right back around and say screw it, but... I don't know. I want to go there and have at least 10. I don't know that I'm going to take all of it, but you know me. I probably will. What's our weight? We're at 49. Uh, I won't take all of it. I'd rather go there with a whole bunch of meat and not really have to be too concerned with our food so cold. than to have a whole bunch of coal. Down for a bit. This time of day, you know what? we got plenty of alertness and we can just run. I totally forgot about all this coal in here. So we got two bears worth of meat here and we have at that one cabin, we have a, basically the majority of a moose. So that put us at eight. There's 10. All this gear is slowing me down. That's a lot. We're at 58. Uh, you're at 93, we can sharpen you. Alright, let's do that. And... Let's repair these. That's 18 minutes. Uh, actually, what are you going to go up by? You're going to go up by 0 0.2. You're going to go up by 0 0.2. Whatever. We're just doing this to warm up over here. And there goes that. Oh, and you know what? We don't probably need all that coal. You can go in there and disappear. And that's our only one. Hmm. Why do I have three pieces of charcoal? Where did I get that charcoal? Uh, travel is at 71. You know what? Why not? Oh, we can't. Oh, yeah. Right, right, right. It uses the knife. Are none of these cured? There we go. There we go. We're good. And we can eat. And you know what I'm going to do just in case. Let's drop two. Wow, we got so many cattails. You know what? Let's just... Let's drop all of it. Let's go. Oh, look at this. Blue skies. And it sounds like they're going to turn into a blizzard. <laughs> well, I 
I don't know if we are in a blizzard right now or what's going on. It's a little odd. Sounds like a blizzard. Looks like a bright sunny day. be cold by the time we get to the cave but that's okay what's the temperature minus 17 is what it feels like man you know you got four deer there and there's a bunch out on the ice can't feel my hands Quite the contrast from the zone of contamination where how many deer are even in the contaminated zone? Two? I think it's actually smart that we're bringing a bunch of meat with us. But that bear is fairly easy. I say that, but watch, I'll get attacked. We might have to go and look inside the dam and see if there is more coal in there. Too cold to think. We don't need like a massive amount of coal, but I really don't know that it respawns. I have kind of one person saying I believe it does. <laughs> we'll find out so we can say we know it does. We're just going to push through this. I want to get there as quickly as I can. Yes, go and find out for you. Well, it should be like any other place, right? I mean, it's typically the outdoor coal that doesn't respawn, but most of it always does. Just kind of funny that there's not a six burner out here and yet there's all this food. Then you go to the zone of contamination and there's a six burner and there's no food. But I guess that's part of the challenge, right? I would like a, a double burner out there though. Probably shouldn't go up, but I'm gonna.
You know, I almost should have just grabbed a couple of those flares and dropped all these torches. And I'm just thinking, we might not be able to go and inspect the, uh, the mine because we don't have lantern fuel. That itty bitty bitty bit that we have isn't going to do it. I swear I just heard chickens over to the right. Somebody's been here. You and hearing. Yeah, I know. I'm always hearing chickens. Is that a sapling? Way out there? Is that a couple of saplings? I don't know that I'm going to go and get them, but... I think at this point in the run... There's no real point in doing it. We're freezing. Smart players would probably stop and build a fire at this point, but... Where's the fun in that? Yeah, good eyes, copper. Yeah, well, where did they go? <laughs> I don't no longer, I, I don't no longer see them. Hmm. Wow. Y'all know I only learned this English language 45 minutes ago. I speak gibberish. Every once in a while something coherent comes out of my mouth. Well, I don't see them anymore. But at the same time, I don't really care about them too much, so I'm not going to spend too much time wasted on it. Funny enough, I think I just saw them when I turned around, but I might be wrong. English language, good. I speak many words. Many, many, many words you speak. I ruined it. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry, Murd. Guess what? I know that this is the cave. I'm learning. If I can get through here without any issues, I'll be doubly happy. This time, oh wow. I totally forgot we had a lot of alertness and that we could be running. start with our worst torch because the way I roll 44 is not exactly a bad one I 
Uh, with any luck, we'll get through here with just this one torch. I don't... Uh, I wouldn't hold my breath on it, but maybe. I'm not expecting to really find any coal in here. We've been through here a couple of times lately, so... I will kind of scan around, but that's about it. Somebody done marked this cave. <laughs> Copper. One. Alright. I'll take that guess. It's entirely possible because I miss coal all the time. According to Coach and Merg. But I don't fully know if I'm actually missing it or if... They just tell me I've missed a certain amount because... That would have made them right. <laughs> Did I? What? I was looking at chat. Now I'm lost. Oh, okay, there. Mert held his breath, expecting me to run through here. That didn't work out. <laughs> well, I don't want to deplete my alertness too much because then it'll affect our carry weight, right? <laughs> no, you miss coal on a regular basis? Yeah, I don't doubt it. Alright, this is the one that always kind of messed me up, but since I put that stick there, that's a big help. Um... I was hoping to use one torch, but whatever. Right. What does this go to? Is this a stick that I put down to tell me a direction? Because that seems to just go to a cliff. If I had any thoughts, well, that takes us nowhere. Where, where did that stick go? Your death is where that goes. Yeah, that's what it looked like, eh? What am I missing here? We came through there. I have another stick. Did I just not understand that I'm supposed to go this way? If I was ever having to come back, like if I thought I would have to come back through here at any point, I would probably throw another stick down. I don't believe we're ever coming back through this cave, and not, not in this run. Still got that hypothermia risk. What's the time of day? It's still technically day. Wow, it might take more than two torches. I was pretty optimistic about one. Because I don't even hear the water yet. Oh, 
Whatever. We can, uh, you know, if we had enough lantern fuel, we could make a nice torch. But I think if we had that amount of lantern fuel, I'd be putting it in my lantern. There we go, finally. This is a big, confusing cave if you don't mark it. There we go. <laughs> I guess that's a good point too. If I had enough lantern fuel, I wouldn't need a torch. Let's eat you. We'll eat you and then we'll drink up and go. Is it the Pleasant Valley Pleasant Valley Farmhouse that I have like a hundred percent torch in the in the bin? I think there's a hundred percent torch in there and a ninety-four percent one. So if we ever make it back there, make a note that I said that I think there's a ninety-four percent one. You might be impressed based on my history with my memory. We don't care about no stinking glimmer fog. We just want to get through here. Did I turn too early already? Maybe not. Alright, so we know there won't be any wolves out in this area. Not until we get to the rose hip climb that we have to worry. Uh, I don't know this area as well as I would like to know it. I'm not sure if I was supposed to go up there. No, maybe I'm supposed to go up here. I don't know. You made a note. Let's see if I uh, remembered correctly. Okay. 194. The fog is weirdly pretty. Yeah, it's the glimmer fog. Why? Am I in the wrong spot? I obviously must be. Oh, damn it. I don't feel so good. Alright, well, let's do that. I think I turned a little bit too early. But I'm not positive. I think this goes where I'm supposed to go. None of this looks like it's where I'm supposed to go, honestly. Uh, I think I turned too early. But eventually I should get to where I need to get to. I hope. Is it up there? Is this the ankle breaker hill? We'll find out. Dead silent out here, except for those crows. Yeah, 
this has got to be the hill. <laughs> I think we're on the right track. Poor Will. It's not my fault he was made of glass, this guy. Him and Glastrid make a good couple. Have a plane crash, neither of them actually looking for each other. <laughs> Both of their minds are thinking, you know... The insurance is a little higher if it's a plane crash. I don't know that that's true. Uh, and another thing right now is we weren't, it wasn't too long ago that we were in here, right? So we might have fairly safe passage. Oh, <laughs> uh, that was a total miss. Right as I say it, right? There we go. I'm picking up those casings because I'm optimistic about finding some lead or another battery. Well, can you still be optimistic about something if you know you won't? Like, I don't know that I won't. I just really don't think I will. But... Here you're going to troll me, but the game just did it for me. Yeah, no kidding, right? Uh, we don't have... Okay. Can we run again? I need to find a place to rest. 38. You wonder if there's any lead in this map. You can't remember. You're not sure. I don't know. Like those big trucks never had any batteries, right? Uh, I don't recall finding any batteries in the mine anywhere. But yeah, I don't, I, I really don't expect to find any kind of lead, but I don't want to, if we do get lucky and find some, I don't want to be like, oh, damn it, I should have been taking all those casings. That's kind of weird. Isn't it? <laughs> That's the weather, it's plus two. Uh, is this Aurora? No, it's too... It's too murky out. Got some weird fog going on out here. Seems completely normal, doesn't it? <laughs> I'm probably just gonna run through the gas because I really don't know where it is. It's with this fog, it's really hard. I'm still not actually in the gas. I'm 
The game is just really weird right now. It's dark out here. Time to look for shelter. All right, glimmer fog is over. The fog looks dirty. Yeah, everything in this region region is dirty. I don't know if you have to take your socks off, but I take them off most of the time. The boots are for sure. The socks are kind of, eh, I don't know. <laughs> Where's the animation of Will covering his mouth there? I think we're out. One more pocket of gas to get through. I don't know that we're going to be able to run through it. But we, we can still see, so I mean, it's not the worst. My insight. I think this one, I'm going to see if I can walk around it. I didn't want to do it over here because I wasn't really sure if I'd be able to see my way back to the main path, but I think out here there's enough markers that I'll be able to know. Yeah, Will's having a rough day. Change the mine site to a mime site. Make it truly scary. A mime is such a shame to waste. Uh. I watched a video on on uh, all the memes. That we all see. And apparently the people that own those sold the rights to them as NFTs. And in some cases got like several hundred thousands of dollars. You imagine you took a picture one day that was just stupid. And somehow it blew up and then one day you just sell it for like 500 grand. There's some rich guy out there. He's got six of them on his wall. <laughs> the rest of us are like, well, I can just take a screenshot of that. I don't want to be here. I'm in the gas. The rest of us are like, I can just take a screenshot and have it blown up. Let me out of the gas. Let me out of the gas. I got a wolf. Am I out? I think I'm out. I cut over too soon. Do I want to take on this guy? We may as well. I mean, we're not in the gas. We're not really losing a lot of... Crap. 
apparently I missed. And we're all good. Still got the gun. Uh, that was a double click. Wow. Wow, Logitech. Robin Hood, men in tights. We're men, menly men. We're men in tights. I never watched that movie. I thought it looked kind of stupid. Sorry. I like the story of Robin Hood, so I didn't want to have it ruined. <laughs> oh no. I can't afford to miss this guy again. A few more wolves out here than I was expecting. It's meant to be stupid. That's what Mel Brooks does. <laughs> Alright. I don't want to deal with this guy. I just want to get inside. I want to be able to run, but I can't. Alright, I think we're good. Get what we have. Close the door. Okay, we got a little bit of water. I wonder how good these torches are. I'll have a look at them in the morning. Put you down right there. And. Alright, we want to definitely drink some tea and. Some birch bark. And then we'll fill our belly. That is good. And top it up. We'll do that. All right, fill the belly, drink up. Wow, we only have 1.8. We had four. Uh, I want to check these torches. I'm not sure I can carry much more. Thirty, forty-two. Oh, we have one that's eighty-six. Dude. And we have two that are at a hundred. Uh, one thing we don't need, I don't know if you can fish out here. Can you? Hmm. We have 11 cloth. What's our clothing like? Clothing's all good. That's our bedroll. 98, it's good. Uh, oh, we need bandages.
Yeah, we got those good torches here. And we have 11 matches. This time of day. And uh, the body. Uh, what to do, what to do, what to do. Should I pull a Murd? Those are two kilograms. They're only slightly heavier. Gotta go. Uh, what's in here? Do we have coal in here? No, because I took it all. Oh, right. I won't. All right, we have three 100% torches. That is beautiful. Uh, let's go up the hill. Have a peek at what's up there. We don't need any cattails. That's just a flag. I know the the cave should have a bunch of coal. I don't know how much, but there should be a bunch of wood and maybe a little bit of coal. Oh no. That stretch is going to have to hang on for a minute. What way did that other wolf run? All right, let's pull it off now. Oh, let's not pull it off now. <laughs> oh, there's two of them. Let's go. There we go. Thanks, Copper. Alright, let's put that away. I need all the stretches I can get. I'm giving out too many freebies at the end of streams. <laughs> I kid, I kid. Why are chickens? How much down? I haven't actually paid attention. We have 12. Murd needed that as well. Every time Nifo stretches, Murd stretches as well. That's not a bad idea, you know? I know there's nothing up here, but I thought I heard huffing. Maybe it was Will, I don't know. Didn't sound like it was coming from him. I think there's just that bunny and maybe a deer over there. Here, Murd, huh? Somebody got some coal. Thirty five. Let's drop, drop 20. Oh boy, there's more. Um, 
You know what? I don't know if that wolf can come up here or not, but I'm not going to find out the hard way. Uh, I'm going to pull this out. And... Uh, you'll go up by 0.2 and you'll go up by 0.3. We'll take 45 minutes. All right. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. Sounds like we got some weather. When was the last time Nifo had a sewing kit? Long ago in a far, far away land. No, it wasn't. It was like... We just had a sewing kit. Oh, boy. How bad is this weather? Do I want to go out or should I just... Do this. Make some water. I wonder if I should make some coffee as well. Now we're finally gaining temperature. Wow. We want to make some coffee for sure. Uh, I think I want to make some tea. Oh, I only have two. And I want to make some birch bark. And do I have anything? No, I don't. Uh, herbal tea and birch bark. I'm gonna drink one and I'll make another one. Water's at 183. both on the same time so uh, we'll just make water until it sounds a little bit better out all right we might get through another one 13 to boiled six uh, you know what it might it did. All right, what are we at? 583. Okay, we're good on water. Okay, yeah, we got a lot of fire making supplies out here. I'm only going out because I don't want to hang out in the cave. I mean, it's probably a better thing to do. In fact, yeah, let's just hang out in the cave. We got a bit of cloth. We got ptarmigan down, so... Uh, we can just do some repairs. I 
I really don't think anything's coming up here. I'm gonna do the pants. Uh, whose idea was it to come to these two regions? What are we at? Five? Uh, what's our hatchet? 96? What the hell? All right. Let's go back down. We got some nasty weather, but I feel okay with making it back there. We got one, two. You know what? I'm going to take you. Because you are good for vitamin C. So if we find any more, we'll grab those too. Hey, coach. Welcome in. Yeah, it was your idea to come out here. Crazy man. You're just on your phone now? Okay. A little better than yesterday, I hope. Yeah, I got the I got the rubber boots on. Oh Jesus! Where the hell did you come from? That scared the bejesus out of me. Please tell me none of you hurt him either. <laughs> I made Murd jump, copper. Coach says bushwhack. I didn't hear that guy at all. I think I want to go down. Wow, that guy scared the hell out of me. I don't think I need to really pick up any sticks. I think I have a bunch of sticks at the, the, the hut. Wow, that was a sneak attack. Stuff like that doesn't happen very often in this game. And I think that was more because of the sounds. I don't think that was a buggy wolf. I think it was just that we couldn't hear him. I don't want to get attacked again, though. But wow. That was a long dart telling me I should have stayed at the cave. No kidding. Alright, well, we have cedar and we have reclaimed wood. Uh, did I have a sewing kit in here? I don't think I did. Nope. How was our clothing faring? Well, you know, the clothing didn't take a... any kind of hit, really. I'm going to take two more pieces of cloth, though. Uh, well, I don't usually do this. Oh, there's my sticks. Uh, 
knives, what are you at? 72, we're probably gonna take. I think that's the one I replaced last time. Who needs to sharpen knives? Oh, damn it. Lazy finger. That sign juts me out just a little bit and it annoys me. <laughs> Alright, well, we're not... I don't know if we're going to be fishing out here, but eh, whatever. And we got just that. Okay. I think we tore everything down in here that we can. Well, we got tables. Alright, well, let's... Where's our hatchet? Let's drop you. Pick you up. We can take down these as well. Wow. Uh, we'll start with you. Oh, it cleared up. Okay, change the plans. Uh, where did I stick? Didn't I have an area? Maybe it was around the corner up here. Yeah, there it is. Alright, let's do that. Uh, we'll pick up that hatchet. We'll drop this one. That is our getting wood hatchet. Or I guess killing time at... What can we do here? Hmm. F5. You know what? Why not? We can boil four liters of water and head over towards the mine. I don't know how much we're going to go through the mine. Come on. Throw you, and we'll throw some stick. There we go. Uh, let's... Do that. You know what I should have done is I... Because I was just thinking, you know what? I should make a birch bark. I should have drank the hot one. I want to make sure I have two. But whatever, we got that one. Now, should we go to the mine or should we go back that way? I think we'll go to the mine first because it's almost night. We'll go when we go that way, I'll carry those other boots. Do they degrade if they're just left outside though? That's I don't that's something I don't know. I mean they obviously freeze, right? So they probably should. Uh we can just go walk around because there was some coal in the main areas, right? Like we didn't actually have to go down ropes or anything. Take care of your boots. I got extras of your boots, coach. I have at least one extra pair at the Mountaineer's Hut. I might have two extra pairs, but I think I broke down one of them to get leather. Because I thought, well, I don't know that I need to have two spares. What is our weight? 53. We're not climbing any ropes.
I'm just a little curious as to... Like, we'll go into the big building and just kind of walk around with our torches, I guess. See if there's any coal. I don't know how much time I really want to spend in there, though. We've done everything we need to do in there, so... Alright, we got gas up here, so let's... Oh, we're in the gas, apparently. Is there a moose out here? I can't remember. I don't think I've ever seen one. I just, I don't remember if anybody has actually said whether there was or not. I know there's the one bear. Being in the mine with no lanterns, risky. Well, we got, we have, I think, three 100% torches. And one that's in its 80s, so. And I'm not going right down into the mine. Like, I'm not obviously going to take any ropes. We're just going to walk around uh, the main floors of the, build, the, the big building. Is that a wolf? Nope. The way those stumps were lined up, I guess they would be uh, fence posts. The way they were lined up, it looked like one was a wolf. Go on these doors. I think I left stuff here too. I don't remember though. It's been a while. Alright, we'll take our. You know what? I picked this up purely to break it down and kill time, and then I didn't do that. I think our crappy 86% torch. And, yeah, we have three 100s. There's coal. <laughs> I found coal. I mean, honestly, we don't have any reason to actually search anything. I found coal. Not gonna be able to carry this load for much longer. Well, we'll get outside and we'll throw it in the travel. I'll leave that can opener. Put you over there. You seem to be a little bit more visible. Let's eat. Yeah, why waste the torch when uh, there's all that coal in that locker or that little. You know what that thing is called? That little box. Alright. Uh, once I get onto the flat ground, I'll throw the travois down. Right about there. And now we have 66. Unbelievable. Well, we just ate, so we can throw all of this in there. And we can throw those. You're basically useless to us at this point. We don't need that yet. And... 
We have our 80% one here. Pull out the gun. What's the time of day? Yeah, who's crawling now, huh? I knew I had left something behind. I really wasn't expecting it to be coal. But now that I have found it, I think that was a tough decision to leave that much when we did that. I think I also had plans of coming back here and grabbing it at some point and just totally forgot or got sidetracked. But it worked out because now we didn't have to search for any. We go look and we find five or ten. Alright, I think I'm past the gas, I think. Did I just enter the gas? I heard a little bit of a sound. It's almost nighttime. I would like to actually go right back to the uh, transition cave. But I think that I'll have to wait the morning. Let's go on this side. I don't like these rolling terrain like this. Get jumped real quick. still one of these wolves that hasn't been touched so uh. all right we got gas right there i don't think i can pull the travel up past it unless i can get up that hill but i don't know i don't remember where that hill takes us i remember there's that that, that uh, walk through cave to our left uh, from the hut you go up the hill and you go left instead of right I remember that brought us out uh, somewhere around there but at this time of night and pulling a travel, I don't think I really want to go and try to find that spot. And I haven't gone past them, have I? No. There's no way I've gone past them. I think they're still coming up. Did I already go by it? My intent is to not leave here without those, yeah. Oh, I'm 
in the gas. Oh wow, I walked way past those huts. I didn't realize. Hey, what's what's a NIFO stream without at least one circle, right? That's where we're headed. <laughs> Nafo spins us right round, baby, right round like a roller coaster. <laughs> Sorry, somehow I missed this. I don't know how, honestly, I really don't know how. We seemingly walked right past it. I thought that gas cloud behind us was the one that was right in front of us. Alright, uh, because of weather degradation, I'm not leaving this outside. I can barely walk with this much gear. We'll pick her up and we'll go in. Okay, there's nothing really in this one, is there? Well, there's my boots. See how quickly I can forget? I was thinking about going over into the actual bunkhouse and sleeping in there, but... It's time. Still a little bit of time before we have to go to bed. Where did I put my boots? Right there. Uh, I'm going to take all of these torches. I'm going to lay you out while I can see you. And maybe even make a little bit more water. Where'd that water go? I didn't take it. Did I? No. And the fire was only long enough to allow it to boil. No, because I, d I wasn't outside, because I, I had this on here for an hour 24-ish, right? And then we went to bed, didn't we? Huh. I don't know how this game works. Something is sapping my energy. Um, I think we can... Really? Did I do that? Pick you up. I don't want to waste you with... Come on, rookie. Oh, no. Alright, we need an hour 24. I don't really want to use a stick. I'm going to be up for it anyway, so what do I care? I think because I was grabbing the water out of the cans that was finished, I was expecting that to be finished. I think 
Okay, anyway, okay, 42.57. I'm gonna have to leave some of this gear behind. Oh, wow. <laughs> we can't move. I don't want to drop anything right here, though. I am losing my mind. I don't really want to drop any of this stuff right where this wood is. Can I move? Yeah. Put it all up here. Uh, you know what? Peter, I don't care. Do that. Just to make sure this fire doesn't go out while I'm doing this. You know what might actually help? Do this. Oh, I missed the table. How did I miss the table? Here. There, now I can see. The fire doesn't actually put off as much light as it should. Or maybe it does. And I'm just trying to be greedy. Alright. You know what? You don't need to be pretty. If you're messy, you might aggravate somebody. And there's nothing wrong with that. Let's take you. And I guess my bedroll is down on the floor. We're at 65. That'll, you know, once we, uh, you know what we don't need? There, now we're light. <laughs> Alright, let's drink up. And I guess we'll, uh, we'll go to bed. So for those of you on YouTube. I thank you for watching and I will see you all tomorrow.